Oh my god. This is okay. <laughs> oh! Red. Ah! Red. Venom! <laughs> Hi! I wasn't actually expecting anyone to show up because it's so suddenly switched many times. Um, also, I forgot to switch the game capture over a second. I. Uh. Frog! Frog! All my plans are everywhere! Everywhere! I messed up my planning! I messed up plans! Um, I forgot just how good the voice actor is. So, hey, great job. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. You know what? Are you good at planning? How are you at that? Oh, I hate looking at his ugly face. Jesus. Um... Do I have to talk to you last time? Because I've already forgotten. I definitely can't take the old man with me though. Why not? He follows you around everywhere. Is it? No, B! I got soaked yesterday. I was drenched. When I tell you every step I took was like I was drenched. Hello Gia! How are you doing? Why is it raining so crazy? You got a typhoon going on? Um, let's see, let's ask him about stuff, because I don't remember him. I'm good like that. I'm really good like that. Is a golden cat charmed out? Nekomania niwa suizen no mato jayo. That's pretty good, I bet. Cat freak would go nuts? I mean, I've seen a golden cat before. Maybe. I would say I'm pretty decent at planning. Really? Well, B, you hear that? Leave all the planning up to Frog. And, I, you know... I, sh I should have known, Frog. Ugh. I mean, after all, you are so good at making decisions. The stream is not really up because of weather. Ah, uh, don't worry. Don't worry. Don't stress about it. Thanks for even putting it. You're a pain in the ass and blame me for the weather. Good. I sent it over to you. If I had to suffer in the complete rainstorm that I had the other day, so do you. What about the blessing? <laughs> I hate this old bastard's face. So much. So much. I don't want to know. What, what if it's um a plot twist and he's actually a god? <laughs> oh, wait. I didn't read that. How is he this? How are you doing? Where should I go? Walking around town with her picture hasn't got me anywhere. The paper on my mirror clock said there's a good court chance. I should see what's in that. I won't be streaming for too long either. I don't even know if I'm going to. I'm only gonna stream until I'm gonna go eat at 1.30. So around 12.30. Wait, 12.30? Until one. I'm only gonna stream for an hour. <laughs> oh my god. Did I really fuck up the time that bad? For some reason I thought it was 11 a.m. still. I'm gonna look into what's in the north. What is in the north? Well, did I not say move? Oh, guidebook, that's right. L, L. How dare you? How dare you insinuate I have lost? Actually, Gio, did you see the... <laughs> did you see the, um, lost babies that me and Faye made on my hood? It was a while ago. I think at the beginning of July. Listen, I thought that was really funny. I, hmm, I guess I can. Yeah, I made loss with Faye. I didn't lose babies. I mean, I don't know. I don't know who you're talking to, but if it's me. <laughs> it better be B. Hey, out of the both of us, who seems like they'd have an L in their would lose babies. I have never lost a baby in my life, and I have babysat at least three babies. Get fucked today, bro. It's not by heading one. Karen is a bird. Not in too old to be a bird. This is that bitch. I forgot. I forgot her nickname is bitch. Is that TV host, Misaki Murakami. You should go talk to her. Well, let's get on then. Let's get going. Overall, man. What the fuck? 
fuck? What? What did I say? Is it the fact that I have like I've babysat before? Are you that surprised I can be responsible for a child? A new sun and tool to rebuild his day. This is impressive. It's so new it's shiny. I like shiny buildings. I don't really like overly modern designs. They're all square and beige and gray with white grout or gray sometimes. I don't like them. Also, you know, I realized, unfortunately, the other day that when I get really emotional, my accent is really hard to control. Like when I get angry, it gets really Australian. When I get really stupid and I try to argue, isn't like the New Zealand accent comes out and then when I try to enunciate clearly and speak to people like evenly it's American um I think I'm just a little gotcha <laughs> of vocals <laughs> how can I see Mr. Kimuruko yes, I have it. just wait for her wait for her outside the building and then follow her home and watch her drink at her favorite bar uh, write down in your notepad what her favorite drink is and what time she leaves. Uh, oh, so sorry. Jim wants to sing in the next. Uh, let's ask you a question, Miss Lady. I want to become an announcer. Maybe I could sneak in some. Excuse me, I'm here to apply for the announcer position. You see that, guys? I'm going to be an announcer. Oh shit. Well, I'll try calling the person in charge. Hmm. Does she not find this suspicious? Is she not going to be the first one that picks up the phone when I call who's in charge? Okay, so how can I get this to Saki Muruka? Um. I, I guess, like, do I directly ask her? I feel like she's gonna be suspicious of me even more. I want to see Misaki. Did you call Misaki Murakami? No, but I'm her. Oh, fucking Keigo. Dude, I don't want to ever learn Keigo. I know I have to for work, but like, I don't like Keigo. Oh, doo doo. I'll be right back. I have to get my cat out of the sink. She was really, for like the past three days or four days, she was really down in the dumps because she had to wear her little turtleneck. And now she's back up to her normal shape. I really thought she'd stop jumping in the sink once she lost her uterus. Her How did she do Um, I think for a month. Oh my god, I don't remember the names. I'm from. I mean, Yukari is a woman's name, right? I doubt she's gonna bully me. Fuck, who was who? Um, I'm Watanabe. That's a nice place to be. Ah! Um, uh, my first name is. Uh, oh, I am totally screwed this up. Sorry, I got it wrong. Are they telling her my name? I'll get it. Oh, they let me restart. Shit. Uh, let's go with Nozu. My name is Nozu. You, you wanna believe me? Receptionist makes the call. The end justifies the means, I guess. I need to talk to her so I can find out. No. I'll wait in the lobby then. Yes, I'll wait in the lobby then. All this way, I can just... I'm waiting in the lobby. Oh, fuck, I forgot they do this. I forgot they tell you the same thing multiple times. I'll take a look around the lobby while she's away. Alrighty.
Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh. oh my god. I was giving you so much shit. I was making fun of the fact that you just barely got all that back and now you've made yourself broke again. <laughs> uh, let's see. Do we want to move around? Gotta ask her about I am. Can I check in? I hear noises. I hear rustling. What is this? This is her. There's an advertisement poster for a TV show. It looks interesting. Does it? No. The receptionist is smiling. As I look at the receptionist, a staff member walks past me. Oh, he doesn't have voice lines? Okay, are you guys ready? You have 1k? What happened to you being broke? Didn't you spend it all last time? Alright. Are you guys ready? Because I'm going to bring out the Uji song for it. Are you mugs way for sightseeing? Uh, not exactly sightseeing. I have some business to take care of. Someone came to Matsue on a trip just recently. <laughs> how is it? Are your toes curling from how bad it is? <laughs> Someone else came. Um, let's see. What's over here? There's a wide open space. You know, you know what? I'm done. I'm done. No more, no more being curious and looking around. Want to curl on itself? <laughs> uh, you're welcome. I will be doing it again if someone else shows up and they don't have a voice. Come on, I can't ask if no one is here. Looking to myself is embarrassing. I gotta make sure they're not fighting. Farm 10 points every five minutes. <laughs> I mean, that's the way to go. Ah. Okay, they're not fighting. Ataho is just losing her shit being a weirdo. Um, let's see. Check the area, inventory. I don't think. No, I'm not. I'm not dumb. I don't need to use that. Television station that broadcasts mainly to Shimane. Oh, wait, I said that wrong. Shimane. No, I didn't. What? Prefecture in Totori Prefecture. Its popular name is, is San Sanjinchuo. You guys imagine if I was illiterate? Wow, that would be that would be. Actually, I am illiterate in Japanese, which is really unfortunate. <laughs> oh my god, its current mascot character is Eto, Eto, Eto. Let's see. Smartphone. I don't think there's any reason to use a smartphone. Love fortune. Envelope, we have postmark. What if about. Um, <sighs> I should start playing more puzzle games to increase my. <laughs> my brain space thinking ability. One of those words. What about this poster here? Ah! You have voice, is it? I look for the source of the voice, and I see none other than Misaki Murakami walking with her boss, arguing. It's Looks like I lucked out, except she seems to be- Oh, her voice. I, I love the voice actor. They seem to be arguing. I'll wait here and see how it goes. I worry for her for the fact that she's got this power. Uh, why are the old guys in this thing have such a punchable face? Was your friend from high school? Yes, but that guy is afraid Listen, lady, what about me? I'll go do your job. All you have to do is whisper in my ears. <laughs> I'm weak to the voice actor, okay? If I... Uh, one of, uh, actually, should we say this? I'm kind of scared. Someone I know is a voice actress, and every time she comes around, I get all giddy, and I'm like, hi, hello. <laughs> uh, I thought he was in love with you. I already voted dozens of times when I did that popularity poll. Mm. 
Is that actually considered sexual harassment? Really? I just considered it a nuisance. The bus leaves. Is that considered sexual harassment? Man. I think I'll wait until she's by herself before I try to talk to her. Is she not by herself right now? Am I stupid? Am I slow? Don't answer that seriously. Is it Misaki Murakami? Um, oh, thank you for that little... <laughs> thank you for the very necessary pan up from her. I feel like a pervert. I stare at her. Of course you do. I am staring at her. Very much so. Glad we're on the same page, MC. She's on TV, so of course she has brooch. That's a pretty unique brooch. She's brooch, brooch, brooch. She's wearing. Is that a red spider lily? Isn't that like always the like the death flag in these things? Oh my! Oh, that's what I am. You guys have already been speaking. How'd you know? Nozu, that's snitch. Guess old high school friends have been in touch. Um, looking for your number? No. <laughs> You know, I'm really great at corny, cheesy lines. If you want a really corny pickup line, leave it to me. <laughs> uh, wait, I still want to ask her stuff. Okay, today's weather? Are you being for real right now? Okay, let's ask about the weather. Can you tell me what the weather is going to be like in Matsue? Oh, that's good. Because it was fucking pouring here. Um... Nice inn. Are we really just having boring conversation? Is there a hotel around here that has a luxurious room and a big bath, but at a reasonable rate? You're an announcer for Shimane, so I hoped you might know. What's wrong with the one we're staying at? That's foul. Guess the Matsui inn will have to do. What do you mean have to do? That's a lovely inn. Oh, he's a bastard. I've got beef with the MC. I don't care about anyone else. I really want to fight the MC. He's annoying. I want to know about Ayafumi. How dare you? I will let this pass and just consider it you having a tantrum. She was a legendary tragic heroine of Matsuyoba High School, beautiful, intelligent, and talented, but fell ill and passed away. Not that I have you know, not that I have no. There's another student by the net named Yeah, you don't remember a student named I have no? Oh, she's a good little actress, I, as expected from an announcer. Think back, there should have been an I have you know. Wait, how do you spell her name? Fumino? Fumino? Fumino. No, that's not how you spell it. That was a spelling mistake. Okay, so far, I don't get why she's called the bitch. Why are you called the bitch? Are you serious? Favorite? Alright, what's your favorite food? I came to ask you, what's your favorite huh? food? I love curry with cutlet. How about you? <laughs> I love senbei. I have some in my cupboard right now. You want to come to me? What a weird, what a weird way to take this. Okay, I was pen pals with Ayafumino 15 years ago. She wrote about you. I tricked her and she fell for it. She looks really nervous now. If she was one of Aya's classmates, which one what could she be? The letter talked about bestie, bitch, and surprise. She talks a lot, so maybe she's bitch. She's a TV personality, so she must be talkative. Dude is so rude. You must be the chatty bitch. What do they call her in the Japanese like nicknames? Why the f why is she called Chatty Bitch? <laughs> they actually call her Bitch? Wow, what happened? This wasn't the reaction I expected. She's pissed off all of a sudden. You're calling her Bitch? Uh, I see, my guess is right. Hence the reaction. I should press the attack. Are you kidding? 
anyone's gonna be pissed off if you call them bitch when they don't know you. Now, do you remember what you were called in high school? The chatty bitch? Asu, this poor lady. I feel so bad. <laughs> she's just getting harassed by this random stranger. She's so upset she's grinding her teeth. She's ready to take a bite out of me. It's not a good look for her. He is acting as if he did not just set this up. Oh, I am too. How do you know my nickname? Come on, I just need to come back to you one more day. I actually don't know the word for security. She storms back into the office, obviously upset. American accent for reading for the win. Total failure, but why was she so upset? I can never tell what women are thinking. I think you are a dumbass. MC, I hate you. I hate you so much. It doesn't seem like she'll listen to me anymore. Let's try some other leads. I hate MC so much. Stim open, I leave. Oh, no worries. Don't trip. Where should I go? Hmm. I should think about where to go before taking any action. Are you serious? Why do we always have to think? Have fun streaming. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I won't be streaming for long. <laughs> Television station that broadcasts mainly to Shimane Prefecture and Toriki. Oh, okay. Same old info. Do I really have to think? Can I just skip out on thinking? According to Misaki's boss, her classmate Four Eyes works at the Civil Welfare Consulting Division. See, I knew that shit. Oh, so unnecessary stuff. Aya's Len has also mentioned a classmate they called Four Eyes. I should find Four Eyes and ask him about Aya. I think I'm getting the hang of this detective. I want to punch him in the face so bad. This MC ooh, almost pisses me off more than the old bastard in the walking. Alright, I'll look for Four Eyes. You're so rude, you- Oi, oi. <laughs> Enjoy the lyric, frog. Don't trip. Let's see. Where- Oh. Oh, I hate going to city offices. I'm at the Matsue city office. The well-built concrete building. Saki's boss said her former classmate works in the civil welfare consulting division. Looking around, I see a bunch of posters and flyers about Matsue. Everyone's working hard, huh? Matsue, the city of international culture tourism. I don't care. I don't care. Don't read out my surroundings. <laughs> There's all kinds of info about Matsue. Disaster prevention, child care support, versus civil welfare consulting division. I do. I, I'm still obsessed with the background illustrations. They're so pretty. I'm going to have to use these as references later on. Hold on. I need another drink of water. Bro, I am so sweaty right now. I can't wait for summer to end. Alright. Looking around, I see a sign pointing to different services. There are counters for family registration, resident certificate, and seal registration certification and so on. I should also respect this resident. Oh my god, I thought those were eye bags. She looks cute. She needs a break. Excuse me, miss. I go to the reception desk. Excuse me, where can I find the civil welfare consulting? She's so cute. You know, she looks like her hairstyle looks a little bit like Keso. She's very polite. She looks like a little bit like Keso. Sounds just like the robots that you get information from. Thank you. They have an annex, some an oh, okay. They have an annex. Somehow I doubt he's listed under four eyes, but let's see what we can find. Will we be able to find anything? Um I don't really care about all this. There's info about the counters where they issue different kinds of credentials. Looks like you can talk to staff members. And info here to make it easy for your warrior around. Hmm. I don't know. I kinda thought something interesting would show. Yeah. Oh my. 
wait a minute. Are the staff numbered? Okay. There are several employees working in the Civil Welfare Consulting Division. I'm not gonna remember. I look around. There are a lot of people with glasses here. I have no idea which one is IS4. Oh. How can we help? Well, I am looking for four eyes. Why is he going around? Calling people by these nicknames that are obviously insults. I think I might be in the wrong place. Sorry. I should leave for now and think about what to do. I rush back to the reception. Can I get information about this here? What do you think? Oh! I'm sorry. I keep on trying to fight with the MC. Ooh! Bring back, bring back the pretty lady at the museum. I need some, I need some cleansing. Um, looks like you can talk to them here. Okay, ask someone. I'm gonna kill this MC. <laughs> All right. Mm. Maybe if we think. Oh, well. What about guidebook? The city hall of Matsuya City, the capital of Shimane Prefecture. The office consists of a main building, a west wing, and four annexes. Oh, I think I'm stupid. I don't know. I don't know. Inventory? This won't help much. Yeah, I thought so. Let's see. Uh, Alright. We already checked all of this, but I guess... Hmm, what about here? There's a poster here, but it doesn't have anything to do with me. It's not MC's fault. It's not MC's fault. I'm the slow one. I I get it. I get it. Um, let's see. What about this one here? What's this? I look at the bulletin board. Matsue courier, 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 courier. Oh, it introduces the staff of the Civil Welfare Welfare Consulting Division. Looking over the Matsue courier, I find a likely candidate for Four Eyes. Civil Welfare Consulting Division. Kosuke Hanaka. Alumni of Matsue Oba High School, graduated from Matsue Sei University, College of Engineering, Department of Science and Engineering. His hope is to serve for the future of Matsue. Oh. Kosuke Tanaka is the only one in the Civil Welfare Consulting Division who went to Matsue Oba High School. He must be four eyes. Looking around, I find Mr. Shethel. Why is that information just available? See, I. You know what? I'll mind my business. Ignorance is bliss. That's Mr. Seto. Mr. Seto, hello. Oh. There's no way this bro. It, there's no way this bro. Why are the dudes so ugly compared to the girls? Sorry, my apologies. Four eyes. It really wasn't like that, but never mind. What brings you to the city? Oh, city office, can't can't oh it's not it's four eyes. Okay. Are you sure you want to talk to me like that? Remember how you detained me based on a false accusation? He is right. I experienced emotional distress, and I have a bruise where Mr. Watanabe manhandled me. You're so you're so dramatic. It's a pretty clear case of assault. So help me out. Mr. Sato seems timid. I could possibly push him to tell me about Hanaka from Matsue Oba High School. Let's do it! Let's do it! Press him! Um, not gonna call him four eyes though. What brings you here today? Uh, so is it. By the way, I understand there's a Kosuke Tanaka in the Civil Welfare Consulting Division who's an Oba High School alumni. Damn, how old are you, bro? You don't look like you're a you're oh, in your 50s? <laughs> Enjoy your lurk, Therese. Um, what does he look like? Love you. Oh, don't, no, don't worry, don't worry. Wait, be careful, run and don't trip. I say, I say, don't trip for a reason. You know this. Don't trip. Don't trip. I think he wore glasses. Also, I heard he has less hair than usual for his age. Oh, he's about to... He must be four eyes I wrote about. 
Can you tell me about Aya Fumi? I'm going to tell you about the school for 10 years. Fumi no Aya is not a name of the school. Wait, okay, boys. There's no way you would have... What? His... Ah, his statements confuse me. I am simple-minded. What the team doing? I am streaming. I am streaming. Um, what's this game called? Red Letter. <laughs> Isn't that art lovely? Um, uh, no. Thank you for the information. Okay, I take back all the shit I spoke about him. I like you, Mr. Sato. Thank you for being a little snitch. <laughs> I'll do my best. Now that I have the info, I should go see him. Wait, no, shit. I should have asked him some leading up questions. I was worried I'd run out though. Come on. What are you up to, Light? Did you make breakfast? I do like Hulk-like features. I, I like Hulk-like features. Um, excuse me, sir. I, I know this is a civil consulting question. Mr. Kosuke Tanaka here? Tanaka wa seki wo hazushite imasu. Why? Why? When's he coming back? Go yoken desu ka? Oh my god, are you about to kiss me right now? Don't get so close, damn. <laughs> why are we getting, why are we getting so intimate? <laughs> Just finished off you? I don't know why. I never expected you to play Fortnite. Hmm, but that's respectable. That's respectable. You know, I really want to start playing Valorant casually. But I'm scared of people. I'm really scared. <laughs> I'm terrified of people. I think if I got into like into an uh because I'm obviously not very good, if I got into an argument on Valorant, I'd be like, uh, uh. <laughs> I get scared easily. It's a person. I'm actually a friend of Mr. Tanaka. I haven't been to Matsue for a long time, so I want to see him while I'm here. Bro, back up! I can feel the heat from your breath. Or maybe that's just me blushing. You are surprised at what I see? He wears glasses and has a prominent forehead, right? Oh, don't tell me this is him. Saikin. What's wrong with playing Valorant? Wait, is there a stereotype about playing Valorant? Like the way there's a stereotype about being a league player? He changed his hairstyle not too long ago. Does he have a mohawk or something? Wait, Mr. Hawk, dude, are you not for us? Bro, can you back up? It's okay. Actually, I really want to try and play with my niece. My niece is really into fighting games. Where's he now? Ah. The office has kids. So they have a lot of kids. Oh my god, I want to adopt another cat. I follow like, um, these charity, not charity, um, these non-profit organizations around where I live and uh, one day one day I'll get rich enough to own four cats why his letter says that four eyes is he like whispering in my ear am I that? thank you I hope he's not too hard to deal with uh, bloody all right, let's get on with it then. Go on, let's go. Out back, right to the back. <laughs> he doesn't look too bad. Why does he look like that though? He looks like a child. Isn't he in his 30s? When I step out the back door, I see Kosuke Tanaka feeding some kids. Oh, Kosuke. He must be Kosuke Tanaka, but wait, he's not wearing glasses. He does look like a cat, his eyes. Mm. He's kind of wearing a weird tie, and his ID has a photo of him with the glasses. Oh, he has a cat tie! You stick to Paladin? It's Paladin. What's that one? Um, oh, he's soft spoken too. Cats are cute. 
I want to. I don't think I. No. できないんですか人間が責任を持って育てていく義務があるんですそうですよね猫たちが警戒していますダメですよそんな怖い顔したらなおフルネコは犬と違ってあれ猫は犬と違ってあれ猫は犬と違ってあれ猫は犬と違
Oh, is this his heartbeat? That's cute. I like that. That's not true. She wrote about a classmate called Four Eyes in a letter. <laughs> I like him. Damn it. He had to bring that up. Great. It's just like with Murakami. I need to get on his good side to get more out of him. He likes cats, right? Let's see. <gasps> I know. Um, Golden cat keychain. There we are. Oh, it's only Calico. By the way, I got a rare cat card. Demi! Hello! How are you? Is it a good morning or a good evening? Actually, I don't know. Yeah. Good morning or good evening? Actually, have you seen... Have any of you seen... Um, what's the name? That movie where the guy is trapped in a dome and his life is a TV show and he doesn't know? I really want to watch that. I haven't seen it yet. I already know what happened. I feel like it's just one of those classic you gotta watch. I catch what I'm trying to do. Alright, he seems interested. This is it. I show him the calico child. If you tell me about what happened 15 years ago, you can have this. Damn it! I guess this charm wasn't actually that rare. I shouldn't push my luck. Okay then, I'll come back. The Truman Show? Yeah! The Truman Show! I. As a child, I believed I lived in the Truman Show. I used to speak to um, wherever I thought there was a camera. I'd turn my head and I'd go, isn't this some bullshit right now? <laughs> like, <laughs> there was one time that I got stuck in a toilet in somebody's house with no toilet paper. Um, so I looked at to the top of the door and I was like, well, this sucks. <laughs> Did any of you t <laughs> in the audience call for help? I was pretty delusional as a kid, though. I also, um, I also believed that cartoons were real. And so when I saw an actress in two different TV shows, I was really confused because I was like, why is she, wait, doesn't she live there? Why is she living here? You actually fell, I didn't fall in a toilet. I got, when I say I got stuck, I mean I got stuck sitting there. Oh, you pissed me off. <laughs> I didn't get stuck. He's aggravating. Yeah, you're aggravating. I'm leaving the city office. I think Tanaka is four eyes, but he won't talk to me anymore. Actually, have I ever fell into a toilet? You know, there was one time I... Oh, what did I drop? I dropped something into the toilet. I can't remember now. Oh, it was my necklace. My ruby sometimes falls off. Um... He was interested in the gold cat charm, though. I should go to Yaegaki Shrine and get that. Do you really want to go to a shrine and spend that much money, or do you want to go to the old man and just get it off of him? Also, I feel- hey, hey. Also, I feel like falling into a toilet is actually a common thing. I won't fall into a toilet. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why are you making that a part of my lore? It's strangely quiet. It's uh, I don't think it's quiet. I hear whispering in my ear. Let's see. Charm. What kind of charm would be good? Oh. She can say charm anytime. Uh, <laughs> oh, I'll take one. Wait, so can you actually romance people? Gave themselves a swirly. Oh, that's the one where you stick your head in the toilet, right? Someone like someone sticks your head in the toilet. Does that stuff ever actually happen? Like, did people actually get swirly? See, I didn't get directly bullied. I would just because I was too stupid to understand being bullied. So <laughs> I just thought they were being friendly with me. Thank you. Um, fortune slip. Excuse me. Hi, what is it? I'd like to draw a fortune slip that comes with a cat charm. <gasps> no! No, thank God. Really? I don't know whether I'm happy to hear that or not. Um, on one hand, I'm happy that people didn't have to go through swirlies. On the other hand, I feel like it would be a really unique cat 
character point. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. There were fights in the bathrooms? Yeah. It was either fighting or smoking. Speaking of smoking, dude, my dad stinks of marijuana. It's like in his veins. He spent a week here and the smell did not go away. Instead, it wafted onto my clothing when he would wash our clothes. <sighs> I'm sorry, but we're sold out today. Sold out? <sighs> What? No. Don't take it out on me. I need to get a golden catch on whatever it takes. Bribe the old man. Unfortunately, we have to speak to the old man. Now what? Calico cat sleeps by. <gasps> oh, it's got a golden cat charm. Oh my god. If someone got done to the toilet, a murder would happen to him. Maybe. I mean, it would be a pushing point. You know what my brother did? My brother used to do that thing where you he would make your fist into a knuckle and like rub it against your someone's head. That fuck, I could feel it. But he would put it right on the soft spot on my head too. Bastard. There's a golden catch on which I just need another color. Yeah! That's it! Yeah! Yeah! Oh my god, I'm struggling, struggling to breathe. <laughs> I run after the calico, but she darts away from me. She's so cute! Please. <clears throat> I'm sorry I said I don't need you. Come on, come here, come in. The calico cat stops by the wall and turns to stare at me with her slitted eyes. Good. I want you to do me a favor. You don't understand my words, do you? Um, actually, you know what? My brother also used to give me wedgies. He, what, what, yeah, a, he, a noogie and he gave me wedgies. Oh, isn't that so foul? He was 17, I was seven. <laughs> Or maybe you do? Nah. Calico cat tilts her head. Come here, Calico. Let me see that golden cat charm. Ah, oh. Dude. It's a quote kind of eventful younger siblings. To be fair, I used to try and get him in trouble to pay back all the shit he gave me. No. I guess so. That's right. Good girl. Come here. What'd you see? Yeah. I know! He was a bastard. I forgive him, though. I mean, I don't. That was fucked up. <laughs> From my own brother. The cat comes to me. Good, you're doing great. Five more steps. Four, three. Calico cat turns and heads off in a different direction. <sighs> Damn it. I was so close. Maybe I should be more tough. Calico, get over here. Cat starts walking toward me again. That's right, I'm straight here. Calico cat comes closer. Keep coming, five more steps. Four, three. Did we not just like get advice from the guy that we have to be cold and hot? That turns again, a different direction, running. How come she doesn't listen to me? Hanukkah and the kittens are so close. Calico cat is keeping her distance. You nice, mean, N ha. Think. Monica was talking about how to treat cats. If you're too kind, they treat you, they take you lightly, but if you're too tough, they get upset. I said it was a fine balance. I should try that now. Thank you! Thank you for using your brain! I walk up to the calico. Um. Uh, let's see. I'll be nice. Don't worry, I'll be nice. Oh, he's so cute! Oh, dear God. That's right, good girl. Oh, it's to me, but turns a different direction. So next, I'll be tough. Hey, where are you going? Not that way, this way. Come on. Cat stops and turns to look at me. Come here. Delco stares at my face. Come here right now. Right now. Did your brother also call you a dwarf? Or... Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> he didn't. What did my brother call me? I don't think my brother talked to me when I was living with him. I don't think my brother spoke to me. I don't think he ever said my name. But there was one time that I sabotaged him. Or I, um, I... <laughs> so he, my brother loves to take his phone into the bathroom to go on it and stuff. And he sits on there for hours. <laughs> classic, classic older brother thing to do. But back when I was a child, um, he like when iPads were getting more common, he would take the the i the shared iPad 
and he would go and sit on the toilet with that damn iPad. So, this is really messed up, by the way. What I did is there's these filters on the iPad, and I squished my the palm of my hand together and took a really close-up photo. <laughs> I took a really close-up photo of my palm to make it look like he had taken a photo of his ass. And I showed it to my mother and my me and sister, and I said, <laughs> Mom, Dean, look what Ronnie did. <laughs> he took he took a photo of his ass, and they started yelling at him. They were like, is this what you fucking do? Is this what you do in the bathroom for hours? You take photos of your ass? Are you sending these photos? <laughs> I was like seven years old when I came up with it. <laughs> he didn't know what to say. He kept on going, no, no. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> that was one of the only times I got him back in a way that left him speechless. Calico Cat starts walking slowly. Last of all, I... Oh, I don't know. Beckoning, keep my cool. Maybe the beckoning one? I'll do the beckoning gesture, like one of those Maliki. <coughs> I beckoned the cat, but she's just staring at the sky. That didn't work. I should try something else next time. Um, Calico Cat starts walking slowly. Last of all, I keep my cool. Come on, you're almost there. Keep coming. Starts to Fuck! You really like making detours. Well, then she won't even look at me. I should try something else next time. Um. Uh, Last of all, do I go back to being nice again? Really? I think that's kind of what I'm back to. Um, I'll be nice again. Quickly, come here. Calico cat comes to me. All right, now I'm gonna hold you in my arms. Success. Lady who owns the cat appears. Hey, Hey, Karu. Hey, Karu. Can we, can we get, get the golden cat, please? Owner walks over to me. Well, that's a problem. The owner's here. I can't take the golden charm and Can I get a gift for being special then? Please? Uh, ma'am? I'll ask about the cat's name. This cat is called Chemical? Um, adorable. What should I do? If I give her the cat, I can't get her the gold charm. The owner is about to take chemical away. Ma'am, to remember this bonding with chemical, can you let me keep it? I'll swap you. I can't let them go like this. I need to stop them. How about a trade? A trade. A gold cat charm doesn't go well with a calico cat. Let's swap it with my calico charm. Come on, come on. A calico should get a calico charm. The calico charm I have would look much better on camera. ちょっとそのお守りを見せてくださる because I have to go and I'm gonna go get lunch. Save. And I haven't gotten dressed yet, so. <laughs> I'm still in my PJs. Close and then. What the fuck? Light, was that you? Light, I swear to God. You just had to do it one time before the stream ended, huh? Woo! Okay, main menu. Return to main menu. Yes. Please and thank you. No, no, you didn't have to be a little shit right before I left. Mm -hmm. Thank you for popping in. Uh, I'm so unfortunate. It was so short, but I seriously got my plans all mixed up. I will see you later, okay? <clears throat> bye bye. Take care and make sure not to trip. Bye. <laughs>